I will also want to say that we're here to support your vision, Dr. Sultan, uh, for, for this uh, for this COP. Uh, like others have said, uh, the global stock take is, is our collective chance to keep 1.5 degrees Celsius within reach. Um, I, I feel optimistic and, and very eager to engage countries in the coming days, and as, as you pointed out, busy days are, are, are ahead of us. But as someone who's participated in this process since COP1 in Berlin in 1995, <laughs> I can't recall a COP where on the first day we agreed on such a momentous uh, elements like we did on loss and damage. And, and for that, I want to congratulate you and, and your team and everyone who made this possible. Uh, we've made some progress on finance, but we, we know we have more progress uh, to make. Uh, we understand from the OECD that, uh, that developed nations have likely reached a $100 billion goal last mm. year, but there's so much more that needs to be done. The, our conversation here is need to be transformational, and when it comes to finance, it needs to be based on, on, on needs, on the gaps that we are seeing, and on access. And this is, this is our role, uh, Yasmin and I, to, to help see this happen. Look forward to, to working with all of you and all of the nations that are present here to deliver an optimistic and hopeful outcome at COP28.